Hi guys, it's Barbara with Quartz Rose Tarot. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so that you're notified when I upload new content. This reading is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Guys, if you're looking for my information to book a personal reading, it's listed in the description box below. Our tarot deck, Magical Fantasy Tarot, is on sale 35% off in the Etsy store. That link is below, so um, you can also find it on Amazon. So let's get into this, guys. Let's get into this for Pisces. So uh, Pisces, it may have taken you a long time to um, get a victory in something here. Or this may be that you got help by your ancestors and angels to get a victory in a situation. Hmm. I see it happening around retrograde. So let's get into this. All 12 signs for Pisces. If you're dealing with an Aries, someone's walking away from a relationship. If you're dealing with Taurus, there's a king of swords, Taurus Virgo or Gemini Libra Aquarius out in the cold. If you're dealing with a Gemini, someone's trying to block you from having a victory. If you're dealing with a Cancer, um, you're, you're back and forth about something, a decision I feel like, and you need to use your intuition. If you're dealing with a Leo, they're wishing to be with you. If you're dealing with a Virgo, somebody's looking back at past mistakes in the relationship. If you're dealing with a Libra, they may be unhappy with the Empress energy. If you're dealing with a Scorpio, there's a lot of drama around a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius, it's illuminating somebody's wish fulfillment. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, they're cutting out a tower moment. So they're trying to cut something out either because it caused a tower moment or before a tower moment happens. So if you're dealing with an Aquarius, someone is moving on from a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. And if you're dealing with another Pisces, they're waiting to rebuild. Okay. It's taken you a long time here, longevity. You've had to have some longevity here. It's been a long time coming here. Uh, growth, this could be growth. It could be that your ancestors were around you helping you through this. Something that's deep rooted could have to do with a past life. You're getting a victory here. And I feel like around retrograde, they're saying no, around retrograde. It says it hasn't happened yet. This hasn't happened yet. Retrograde is April 1st, so we'll be going through the shadow stage probably around the 15th to the 20th of this month. So let's get into this, Pisces. So you're resurrecting something. Or this could be your judgment is to move on in divine timing. It'll work out. So I feel like that's probably what you're doing. So what you're saying here, Pisces, is that you're going to just try to move forward. And what's meant for you will happen when it's meant to happen. So it'll all work out when it's meant to happen. You could be dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. This is a partnership, but you're trapped in your head because of the betrayal. You've got to see things from a different perspective. You ended it because of all of the drama. Third party drama and all the mind games and manipulation here and the harsh truth of it all. I feel like for you, it got to be too much with all the mind games and manipulation. This person, you have two fives. Fives are about change, but this is also about, you know, ending of all the drama with a third party. If there was a third party here causing drama in your relationship, <clears throat> I feel like somebody was playing to win, right? They're playing to win. I feel like for you, 
This is the harsh truth of it all. What is? What is the problem and how is it affecting Pisces? Okay. This might be about you going on vacation. Something may have happened while you were on vacation. Somebody could have been having sex with somebody while you were on vacation. It's illuminating sex with could be with a water sign while you're on vacation or while the water while the water sign was on vacation. Tell me about the problem here for Pisces. Where there's partnership is concerned, you're moving on from the burden. Pisces, there you are. The harsh truth was illuminated. Okay. So the harsh truth was illuminated about a third party and waiting, waiting for this, you know, feeling discontent about this tower of the truth, trying to master your emotions. So you're, you're figuring out that somebody may have cheated on you while you were out of town. Um, they may have been trying to hide their deception, but I feel like trying to move on from all the drama. They may have tried to hide their deception from you, may have been trying to hide something, but you're moving on from all the drama and leaving somebody out in the cold. You know, I feel like this is a you kind of throwing your hands in the air and saying, if it's meant for me, it will be right? Like things will work out the way they're meant to in time. If that's what's meant for me, it will be. So you found out somebody was cheating on you while you were out of town. You're manifesting, closing this cycle out. Somebody may be trying to contact you to try to start over, try to mend fences, trying to, you know, enact a change, have a new beginning, or somebody may tell you that somebody's pregnant. Tell me about this Queen of Wands. You're trying to master your emotions about the truth about this Queen of Wands. You're heartbroken. Your wish fulfillment is to secretly move on to a new beginning. You may be trapped in your head, wanting a victory over the drama. So I almost feel like you want to give it back to him. It's like, you know, you're trapped in your head wanting a victory because of the drama of somebody from the past. You feel like it was going on for a long time. You're unhappy about this.
you know, I feel like for you, I, I don't know if you're trying to come back from the battle victorious because there was a lot of drama from the past that went on for a long time, causing you to be unhappy and discontent. You're confused about this queen of swords. It's almost like this is a transformation of this emperor to cut somebody out. You're, you're wondering how this person got, got in there. It was with their mind games and manipulation. So this is like you wanted the victory, but this drama from the past was going on for a long time. Yeah. So y this person played mind games and manipulated this emperor into breaking up with you or letting you know what was really happening. And this is, this is why this relationship ended. You may find out that this person uh, is pregnant or you may try if they may want you to think that you manifest in closing the cycle out though. You're trying to just move on from this nonsense. And you're right about that, Pisces. If it's meant for you, it will be yours, um, no matter what happens. So tell me how this ends for Pisces. Mm. They're saying caution, give it time. Okay, tell me about Pisces. So I feel like somebody is sabotaging a relationship or trying to work on sabotaging. Someone may come in all sweet and cooperative. Somebody may come in and act like they're there to be a friend or whatever, you know, lending a helping hand kind of this, but it's to sabotage. So that's why they're telling you, use some caution here and give it time. This person's up to no good, Pisces. This, this is, this is an energy of somebody who's up to no good. It's interesting that they're manipulating somebody here. I feel like there's an ending. There's an ending because of the harsh truth of the betrayal of a third party. The truth came out here. You got the clarity you needed about the new passionate beginning. Pre-Empress energy, you're back and forth here about this King of Pentacles. You don't know what to do. You don't know what to do in this case. You secretly want to hold on, but you know you'll regret it if you do. So you're at a crossroads about this commitment. Because of the deception, you're trapped in your head and want to move on. So I feel like divine timing's at play. So things will happen when, when they're meant to happen, right? Um, but you're still heartbroken over this tower moment. So I feel like this will turn around when it's meant to, because I feel like the divine is going to make it so. So guys, that is all I have for you. If that resonates with you, please leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I hope you have a blessed week.